Can masturbation possibly cause you to lose part of your penis? Can the way you masturbate actually put you into the emergency room or give you an infection? Unfortunately, the shocking answer is yes. You might think that this is a joke. It's not, it's real. And you should be aware of it so that it doesn't happen to you. So, stick around for the whole video and you will learn why certain masturbation methods can be dangerous based on medical reports and scientific research. Welcome to the Cure the Expert channel. Cure the Expert is a California Medical Board registered telehealth clinic focused on men's health. Knowledge is provided by licensed U.S. physician, Dr. John Wu, MD. I'm Cure Expert Science Analyst and your host, Eileen. Masturbation is usually good for you as it releases feel-good hormones and actually reduces the risk of prostate cancer as seen in this study. But most people do not know that certain masturbation methods can cause injuries serious enough to hospitalize you. To be sure, these injuries are not everyday occurrences. However, if these do happen, you may end up severely damaging your penis. Harmful masturbation number one. You can get a fracture of your leg if you fall down hard enough. But do you know you can get a fracture of your penis? It's called penile fracture. And according to this study with over 3,200 patients with penile fracture, the cause of about 40% of the cases is due to too intense of a masturbation and also masturbation that includes bending of the penis. What happens during penile fracture is that you hear a popping or cracking sound followed by severe pain and swelling in your penis. Basically, the tissue in your penis has cracked in half causing lots of blood to bleed into it. You must go to the hospital quickly because this is an emergency. You need surgery ASAP. What the surgeon needs to do is to cut open the penis and stitch together the ruptured penile tissue and stop the bleeding. Of course, just like fractures of the leg or arm, penile fractures do not happen that often. But to be on the safe side, doctors generally advise that you should avoid bending the penis when you masturbate. Harmful masturbation number two. As explained in this research, this type of masturbation technique that can be very dangerous is called penile incarceration. No, it has nothing to do with putting your penis in prison or something that you get from a prison. Penile incarceration is when you put your penis, when it's not erect yet, into a small object, such as a metal ring, a plastic container, a glass bottle, or a rubber band. Some people get pleasure from this. Others use it to maintain an erection. But the problem is that when your penis gets hard, your blood and other fluid swells up the head of your penis and your penis gets stuck in that object. If it gets too severe, your penis tissue can start to get purplish gangrene and die. Also, you cannot pee at all, so your bladder becomes painfully big. The longer you wait to go to the emergency room, the worse it gets. So usually the surgeon has to put the patient under. Then, the surgeon sticks a needle into the head of the penis to try to drain blood and other fluid to deflate the penis a little bit. A needle that penetrates through the abdomen into the bladder is used to drain the bladder of urine. Next, the surgeon either attempts to cut the object with a saw or tries to slide the object out using a thin tube or string. Sometimes, the skin or the penis tissue itself at the obstructed area has already died. 
So more surgery needs to be done to strip the dead skin or dead penis tissue from the penis and replace it with healthy skin from somewhere else. Harmful masturbation number three. This type of unsafe masturbation technique is something called the traumatic masturbation syndrome. That is when you masturbate by rubbing your penis against your clothes or bed sheets or something hard, or when you masturbate by lying down with your stomach and your penis pressing against the floor or bed or sofa. Researchers, for example, in this study, have found that this kind of masturbation can give you erectile dysfunction by making your penis desensitized. The result is that when you have sex, your penis does not feel much, and you end up with not being able to have an erection or an orgasm. If you are practicing this type of masturbation, you may want to rethink this and try other ways to masturbate. Harmful masturbation number four. The fourth kind of harmful masturbation method is when you stick a thin object, such as a metal wire, into the urethra of your penis. Your urethra is the opening at the head of your penis where your urine and sperm comes out. For this problem, usually what happens is that you end up at the emergency room with an infection or a difficulty in urination because the object gets stuck deep in the urethra. What surgeons usually do here is to remove the object with a device called an endoscope. I hope you guys found this video to be educational and interesting. If you like this video, please subscribe, like, and share. Thanks for watching. See you next time.